Welcome to a new week of The Rundown. On this episode, the winners of a historic leadership award have been announced. The Navy wants your feedback on stress and a response team to help prevent family violence. The winners of the Captain Joy Bright Hancock and Master Chief Anna Devartarian Leadership Award have been released. Congratulations to the five sailors recognized for their contributions to their workplace through leadership and fostering a positive work environment. You can read the names of the five winners from our story on Navy.mil. 42,000 sailors will have the opportunity to participate in the Navy Behavioral Health Quick Poll. The poll was established by the 21st Century Sailor Office. It's designed to examine the amount and source of stress sailors experience. The poll will also examine how sailors react to stress, as well as perceptions and knowledge of available resources. The poll will take less than 10 minutes and will consist of 17 multiple choice questions. Sailors will be invited to participate at random and will be notified of their selection via email. To read more on BHQP, read our story on Navy.mil. Finally, the Navy created a response team that will help reduce child abuse, neglect, and domestic violence among sailors. The High Risk for Violence and Coordinated Community Response Team is designed to provide rapid assistance, safety planning, and risk assessment in response to an incident of family violence. The team is ran by CNIC and will provide support to threats of violence to service members, families, or unmarried intimate partners. Full details of the responsibilities of the response team can be read in NAVADMIN 093-17. You can also find links for child abuse prevention resources and month of the military child in our story on Navy.mil. Well, that's all for this week. For any questions, send us a message at usnpeople.fct and Navy.mil. For the Chief Naval Personnel, I'm MC2 LJ Burleson. Thanks for watching.